What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of Offroad Outlaws. In today's video, we're going to be talking about some sneak peeks that the developers did actually go ahead and post out on Facebook. Now this is legit stuff, this is from the actual developers, so we're going to go ahead and get straight into this. Now this is going to be an extremely cool update that is going to be coming out in the future. We do not know exactly when it's going to come, but here are some of the photos. So this is our first photo right here, as you can see. It says 1 out of 5 jobs. And there is setup, prop, unlink all, payback 100%, 0%, 50%. Then, you know, the information on it asking about, you know, what is the job, what does it do. And then if you look at the right side, it says job unload point big, align by slope, everything else that is pretty much normally the same. So you can tell that we're going to be having like a job system in the game that you can put inside your own custom maps to where we can, you know, make money from doing these jobs. And you can have five different ones placed out through the whole map, which is actually pretty cool. Especially the fact that you can change to how much you earn from it. Now if we go ahead and take a look at this next photo right here, this looks like it's actually a map photo on the map, Woodlands. And as you can tell right there on the left side it says, You, Job Load Station, Job Destination, Your Mark, Tap to Put rescue mission and route and if you look at the map you can see the job load station is sort of in the top left of the map there's a rescue mission in the middle and the very bottom so that's definitely going to be a really cool thing especially inside the game being the fact that i make videos where i go out and rescue vehicles that are out and stuck and stuff i don't have to actually set up all that and there's already pre-made vehicles that are just around here that we have to go and rescue honestly i think it's going to be really cool especially that you can place your own routes you can mark and tap to put your like your marker on there so you'll have like a waypoint of where you need to go to there's a job destination and the load station which i think is honestly really cool and if we go ahead and go to this next picture right here it says name available jobs warehouse number one number three there's a bridge and a warehouse number two to start a job enter the nearest load station so you have to enter a load station it's probably going to start up a job for you where you have to maybe go pick up some logs you got to go pick up a tractor as you can see right there, maybe some boxes full of goods, or as you can tell, some rocks. So you're going to need 20 logs, 3 tractors, 40 boxes, and 50 rocks. And this will be available for warehouse 1, 2, and number 3. And looks like we are going to have to be able to possibly build a bridge or something. As you can tell, they did complete that, and they completed 1 out of 3 tractors for the warehouse number 2. So guys, let me know down below in the comments, what do you think about this little extra thing? Before we actually leave, if you look in the top right of the screen... On this picture, you can see that there's like a little truck right there, a box truck. And I'm guessing that's maybe the job button that you click on to open up your job menu and take a look at this. But honestly, I think it's pretty cool. It's going to be a really nice update whenever they do come out with it. And we can't forget about this right here, about the gear ratios. It does say that's fixed. We do have an update to fix it on your end though, and it's going to be pretty soon. Now that does not mean that the update is going to be instantly like right around the corner or anything. We're not going to bug the Offered Outlaws developers about the update and when it's going to come out. But I would just stay patient because we bug them and everything. The update's not going to come out correctly so let them do their thing. Besides that guys please be sure to like and subscribe and turn on post notifications.